Good choice. Scott, how'd you characterize the round today? Solid. You know, I uh, did a really good job, you know, kind of keeping the ball in front of me. I uh, hit a bad drive on eight and, you know, kind of took my medicine, wedged out of the bunker and, you know, hit a wedge shot to 10 feet and made it and, you know, capped off the front with a nice birdie on nine. And uh, I drove it great on the back. I just, you know, kind of every wedge shot was just a little bit long, a little bit short, and just kind of not really as tight as I was on the front. Um, you know, kind of uh, not disappointed, but obviously happy with my score. But the way I played, I definitely felt like I left a few out there. Do you feel like as the season's kind of gone along, your game has gotten stronger as we kind of come towards the end of the end of the year? End I of the guess. Season? I guess. I, I feel comfortable with what I'm doing, you know, kind of tee to green and, you know, just kind of continue down the path that, you know, kind of set and, you know, happy in the position I'm in, I'm in after two days and looking forward to the next two. Do you keep in the back of your mind what you need to do to get to East Lake? No. <laughs> I mean, because as whatever I was 10 minutes ago has probably changed now. So I can – you know, kind of do what I do and, you know, hopefully, you know, make the change on my own and, and, you know, hopefully that'll be enough. But we got two more days of golf in front of us, but, you know, happy with the way I handle myself the last couple. A lot of guys kind of talk about good golf takes care of the rest. Is that kind of your, how you feel about kind of going forward with that? Yeah, I mean, the fluctuations are by the second out there. And, you know, you, you feel like All right, if, I'm, if I'm in this position, then, you know, then this that'll be good enough. And then you look up there and it's, you know, what you thought was good enough is not. And then what you thought wasn't good enough was. And so, you know, you drive yourself crazy uh, all throughout and, you know, go out there. And, and especially if you get kind of caught up in those kind of things, you know, it doesn't take very much to be off out there to make some bogeys pretty fast. So, you know, try to focus on that. And then the rest of that will hopefully take care of itself. Thanks, Scott. Good. All right. Thanks. Thank you,